Hey guys, Christy Channel here. I'm just starting to make some goat's milk lotion. I already pasteurized my goat's milk and I added, so it's 50% goat's milk, 50% water. So in their room temperature, I just uh, warm them up, just mix them, put them in this bowl. And I just mixed up my oils here and heated those so that they're all melted. In here is coconut oil, almond oil, shea butter, um, emulsifying wax and stearic acid and then I'm going to be mixing my oils into my goat's milk and water here and then I'm going to mix it with a stick blender then after that I'm going to add optifin that is our preservative that's a very natural preservative and then I'm going to add our scent and we're going to be using coconut lime verbena so and I have to measure those out as well um, before we do that. So I have my uh, my bottles all set here to um, start pouring once the whole process is done. So that's basically what I'm going to be doing. So have fun and enjoy watching. So I'm going to mix my oils in here. Good. If your temperature is um, too extreme, like your oils are too hot, and your um, goat's milk and water is too cold. Basically what it will do is it'll get super chunky and um, you'll be able to see it when you mix them and it will be kind of gross. You want to try to get them to blend well so that you want them about the same temperature, which these are. You can see it's, it's going to get a little thick looking, but um, it shouldn't be like chunky though. Alright, so I'm going to use my stick blender now. Let's mix this up a bit. You don't want to let it get too thick because we still have to mix in our preservative and our scent. So we're just doing it enough just to smooth it out here. So once it's pretty smooth, I'm gonna go and measure out my Optifin, which I forgot to bring over here. So I'm gonna measure this. Perfect. So I'm gonna mix that one in. measure out my coconut lime verbena. This is our fragrance for this goat's milk lotion. Okay, now we're going to add our fragrance a little bit at a time. Again, we don't want this to get too thick because then it's going to be hard to pour into our bottles here. So you want to keep an eye on your consistency. You like to pick the stick blender up to kind of see where we're at. All right, I think that's about good. So now I'm gonna move things around a little bit. Over here, get everything out of the way. So I can get my bottles over here. Then I pour from my big container into my small one. with the aluminum bottles because you can't see as you're pouring. 
So I have to be a little more careful with these filling them. These are eight ounce bottles. If you guys have any questions or comments, feel free to comment below. Thank you so much for watching this video. This is our all natural goat's milk coconut lime verbena lotion. It's available for um, $15 a bottle for the eight ounce. And you can check it out on our website, channelhomestead.org. And check out our online store and what we have in stock. We also make it in lavender and we do it in the eight ounce and the four ounce. Like I said, this, the aluminum bottles take a little bit more concentration because it's hard to see as they're filling compared to the glass bottles. The company I order from was actually out of the clear bottles. So that's why I got the aluminum because I didn't want to not be able to make any lotion. So um, if you guys want to see more videos like this, um, just like and subscribe and feel free to leave comments, any questions, we're happy to answer. All right, I hope you guys enjoyed this video.